Hello and welcome back to another vlog. I'm Lumen and <laughs> I can't get used to it. I can't do it. Just those three words, I am Lumen, they throw me out of whack completely. Ah, I don't know why. I suppose it's because I've been doing the same introduction, the exact same introduction for like the past year and a half or two years. I suppose that's why. But man, those three words have me all out of sorts. I'm trying to introduce myself at the start of my videos because all the other YouTubers do it and I feel like being a sheep when it comes to this. I just feel it's a good idea to let everyone listening or watching know that I am in fact Lumen. That the voice that they're hearing or the person that they see in is Lumen. So that's why I'm doing it. I am struggling with it, yes. But I think it's for the better. I may well change it or modify the way I say it or whatever over the next little while. Make it right, make it me. But I'm going to try keep it in there. I know I didn't just start recording this vlog to say that. <laughs> that was impromptu. <sighs> that was just because I had to get it out there. I had to get that weight off my chest. So, I'm feeling better now. That's what this vlog is actually about. It's like a mini channel update again before the proper June of 2013 channel update, which is going to have to go up within the next five days or so. I thought I'd just let you guys know that I am in fact feeling better now. I got sick twice in a row, for those that didn't know. So I got sick the first time, I recorded an entire Q&A while sick, which was okay. I mean, the Q&A ended up being kind of fun, reasonably okay, reasonably good. Then a couple of days after that, I recorded a vlog saying, well, hey guys, I'm feeling a lot better. I'm gonna get back to work now. But what happened then was I pushed myself too hard. And I keep doing that, that's like the story of my life. I pushed myself too hard, my immune system just plummeted, and I got sick again. I probably reinfected myself. But I'm better again. And now I want to say I'm taking it easy, but that's not really a good way of explaining the situation. I'm just not going to be pushing myself as hard as I did before, because that's probably the reason I got sick in the first place, the first time, not the second time, the first time. Because I wasn't getting enough sleep, I wasn't eating enough, I was spending too much time here, in front of my PC, talking at my mic. <sighs> I'm going to try and make sure that doesn't happen again, because... All of this happened at such an inconvenient time as well. It happened after the previous channel update where I was like, okay guys, crunch time. We're gonna do this now. We're gonna improve the views on the channel, we're gonna get more subscribers, and we're gonna pump a whole lot of videos out. I said that, but I didn't do that. I tried to do that. You know, I really crunched. And perhaps I crunched a little bit too hard. But anyway, I'm feeling better now. Helene is looking after me, and hopefully I won't get sick again. I've got layers upon layers on most days, because it is in fact winter down here in South Africa, and it gets a little bit cold. I've even stopped myself from taking Nero's for walks when it's like incredibly stormy outside, which feels absolutely terrible for me. It really does. I feel so guilty, because he deserves his walkies. I want to take him on them, but in exchange, in return, I'm taking him to the bee more often. I say bee because I don't want to say the entire word, it may alert him to it. And he's having a nice nap nap, so I don't want to do that, I don't want to do that now. But I throw the bee for him, on the bee, and he loves it. Do that more regularly, gets good exercise, he's happy. We're also going to the farm this weekend for Oren's birthday. We'll get some exercise there. Play with other little doggies. My parents actually got a new dog, which they sort of adopted from 
either one of the neighboring farms or someone in the little town close to them. It's a little Jack Russell. Apparently it's playing up a storm with Sophia. I can't wait to introduce him to Nero. I can't wait. Nero's amazing with little dogs like that. <laughs> I don't know if he's even really come into contact with a Jack Russell before. But those, those little guys are crazy. They truly are. So I'm assuming that this one's going to be the perfect fit for Nero. Now, with that out of the way, uh, with me just finishing up, telling you that I'm looking after myself, I will tell you what I'm going to be doing over the next couple of days. I think I'm going to be focusing on newsmans and adventure worthies for the most part. I still need to get my Bioshock Infinite post impressions up, which I can't wait to talk about, but I have had trouble forming thoughts of. If that even makes sense. It's so difficult to try and comprehend all of it. That I've just been trying to get a couple of notes written down or typed down or whatever. And I want to do it properly. So I'm going to get that up soon enough. I've been really happy with the amount of newsmans I've been getting out. Like, really, really, really happy. That's the one piece of content I could actually do and do well while I was sick. Sure, my voice may well not have sounded as good as it usually does. Not that I'm saying it sounds good, but you know what I'm saying. I could at least get those episodes up. And now, I'm hoping to be able to focus on Newsman and Adventure Worthy while still getting Metro done and searching <laughs> for an access code for Cube World. That is, that is one thing I've been unable to do. I have mailed Wale, who's the creator of the game, so many times already. And I actually mailed him before, but he never replied before the whole alpha thing started. But the Cube World alpha could have been such a big thing for my channel. Sadly though, it looks like I'm not going to be getting in any time before the rest of the populace gets in, which is okay. I don't see myself as big enough on YouTube or as a big enough personality to be able to just demand access and get it. I realize there are a couple of people out there that actually got access to the game and aren't using it, which saddens me a little bit, but that's just the way of things. Maybe one day I'll be able to just ask for something and get it, but I'm keen for Cube World. I really, really want to play it, and I have a whole bunch of ideas for Cube World related content that I might get around to doing regardless of not having access yet. We'll see. We will see. If you have some magical way of getting in there, let me know. I'm super keen for that. I'm also super keen for Hearthstone, which may well be starting soon. I'm going to be covering that in a big way. I know Magic the Gathering Duels of the Planeswalkers 2014 is coming out today sometime. I might have a look at that as well. And that's it. I've got like two or three adventure worthies in the pipe, getting ready to upload, and I'm feeling good about it. I really am. I've also been playing a little bit of Guild Wars. I did a bit of the Dragon Bash stuff. I haven't had a chance to check out the new one, which is Sky Pirates of Tyria, the new update that they released. I read that they're going to be releasing content updates every two weeks soon, which is like... Ugh mind-bogglingly crazy. I don't know if I'm going to be able to keep up with all that content, but I'm going to try. I made a Mesmer and I've been enjoying the class immensely. I'm still trying to think of how I can record videos for Guild Wars. It just seems like every time I get into the game, there's nothing I can talk about easily, but we'll see. And that's it. That was all I wanted to talk about in this video. I realize it's a bit shorter than usual, but I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm okay. I'm working at getting back to work at full capacity, but not above full capacity because that would be a little cray and I might get sick again. So we'll just stick with full capacity. 100% is okay. For now. We'll see about going higher in the future. So, check back soon for more. Most important here. Happy trying not to get sick again. All of you. Because it's terrible. Take it from me, it is so, so bad being sick, especially twice in a row. Don't do it. If you have the choice, don't get sick. Happy that.